Welcome back, YouTubers. Um, this is actually kind of part two. I just said on my last video to check this one out. So I wanted to show you this product that I'm going to be using, uh, Refusion 1 and 2. Uh, I've been using it now for a couple of days. I picked it up at Big Al's, um, which I guess in America you guys would only have it online, Big Al's. But in Canada, we actually have the Big Al's store. So anyways, they're... Um, their calcium they say it's better than purple up I was actually going to use some purple up and so basically you can read it there that's what it's called and it's a uh, C-chem so if you want to you know google it or whatever so what I'm going to do is we're actually going to show you what it does it does something pretty cool when you add it to the water and I'm going to show you what it does and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you my tank I'm going to turn the other light on and first, well, actually, I'll talk, we'll put this in first because it's a two-stage process. So, for a 90-gallon, I'm going to put in uh, about three caps of step one, and it's got to go into the sump. It has to go somewhere with high flow. So we just pour it in there. And one more. Okay, then uh, I'm going to explain to you and show you the tank so you can see what the conditions of my tank are right now um, you can pretty much just see where we are looking around and this stuff's supposed to help with the purple and uh, with the coralline algae and with the corals and I don't know that's what they said at the store anyway so this is going to be the real test mode is we're just going to um, see what happens and I'm going to make a follow up video in a few weeks or a month once I have some notable difference, or if I feel that I should have had notable difference and I don't, then I will uh, let you know. But right now, all coralline algae in the tank was on rocks I purchased with it. Um, I bought snails with it. So, we're going to see how much this stuff helps. Hi, buddy. You ever notice how happy they look? This guy's happy too. They're all best friends. He's, I got the three of them. I only got three in here, but they're best friends. They all just hang out doing their thing. Okay, so now we're going to add step two. If we just show the bottle here. Um, so it's refusion number two. You do have to get both bottles. I don't know. It's going to be three caps of this one as well. So I want to show you. If you're watching, look, it starts having a blizzard in the tank. And it makes all kinds of little white things. I don't really know what the idea is with them. It doesn't say anything about shutting pumps or skimmers off. So I just go ahead and I leave them on. And just kind of hope for the best. The fish try to eat it. Um, if, as far as I know, it's just calcium. So I don't think it's really going to hurt them. But uh, it's pretty cool. And then within like a minute with the pump and the skimmer running, it's, uh, it's cleared up. So it's, I, to me, the what I kind of figured is if it's getting into the pump, it's just going to sit right there anyway, and it's still going to be exposed to the water flow. So that's why I don't shut anything off, but it didn't say to. So that's basically it. That's all I wanted to show you guys was just that. You can see it's almost gone. Um, it's a real quick process, real simple to d use. It says use it every one to two days. And... Um, yeah, I don't know. I, it's new to me. There is actually another product I'm going to try next after this. I got talking to the guy up at the store the other day, and um, the one guy was recommending a different product. It's a one-bottle product. Um, I guess everyone's got their opinion, though. Like, you know, a day earlier, the other guy sold me those two. So, I got a little bit on the floor here wipe that up before it stains or something I don't know um, I should really test it it does say on the bottles do it says never mix the two directly together I'm not really sure why I don't really have anything to try that in just out of curiosity ah eh, fuck it whatever um, if you get some try mixing the two together directly in a cup or something I got no idea why what the, what the problem is maybe it foams like you know vinegar and baking soda who knows um, 
But do me a favor, rate and subscribe, and uh, you know, then if you know if this is your thing, if you like saltwater aquariums, you can uh, learn with me, and we'll see what happens with this stuff. That way, you're not running out and buying it for no reason. And I uh, hope you guys like my tank. I, I'm pretty happy with how we've got it set up here. Um, everything seems happy, seems to be doing well. Fish are all excited. Hey, you know what else is really cool? This here is called a feeding ring. I'll show you this quickly. The fish have already ate. But I'll, I'll give them a little more. It's not going to hurt. I'm just going to show you this because it's really cool. I bought this thing for $3 because I had a problem with all the uh, food going down the overflow there. Because it's floating pellets, right? So then I got this sinking pellets one which you pay $10 for this little bottle compared to $10 for the big bottle and watch this just uh, just gonna put a couple little pieces in so that's all I do um, I'm lucky I work from home so I generally just feed them very small amounts four times a day and if we look up the food just floats there until it's ready to sink and now it'll kind of almost like snow down into the tank and you're going to see the fish come running. The clownfish gets really excited. Um, he normally goes crazy, but they just ate not long ago, so they're probably not even hungry anyway. I just wanted to show you guys the um, what's going on there. But now none of it is going down there. It just sinks to the bottom and that's where like you know the little cleanup, cleanup crew can take care of it. So, that's it guys, uh, Coral Beauty, he's going to get something to eat, maybe, he's looking around, I don't know, he's picky, but I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video, yeah, don't forget, rate and sub, thanks guys, bye.